these are all our parcels he had some a toothbrush before but he chewed it and it's like it's no longer functional so Welcome to my channel, Molly Mo. To those who are coming back, I'd like to say thank you for being here. And to the new people, I would like to say welcome. And I hope you will stay and be part of the family. In today's video, I'm going to be unboxing and showing you my grocery haul here. I buy my groceries mainly on two applications, uh, two Chinese applications, Taobao and Pindado. Uh, actually, these applications only work for people who are in China. So I'm going to write the names of the applications here because I'm not quite sure of the pronunciations. Firstly, I'm going to show you where I get these boxes. When they arrive, uh, they don't come straight to my doorstep. They are dropped at the post office, parcel office, where I go and collect them. So when they are dropped at the parcel office, I receive a message that tells me that my parcels are ready for collection. Then I go and collect them. So let's go to the parcel office. according to what I need and what I do not have in my in my house so these are the things that I need at the moment and uh, here I'm going to be giving you uh, the grocery the items prices in Chinese yuan and in US dollars as per as per bank rate so firstly we have this five they say 5 kg cooking oil. I bought it for 47.9 yuan. That is $7.50. $7.50 for 5 kg. <laughs> In my country, they always say liters. But here, you can find 5 kg cooking oil. Here, I have this baby. I like her so much. Um, this is uh, a cleaning cream from where i come from we have what we call handy andy a product of unicef unilever i'm sorry a product of unilever so this is more like handy andy and she does exactly what handy andy does so it's going for i bought it for 20.3 un that is three dollars 20 cents this is also a product of unilever three dollars twenty cents mm, and i have this glycerin this is chinese glycerin it's cold right now so i need the glycerin i add it to my lotion and to my ingrams then the next item is this washing liquid 
it was on a promotional sale i bought it for 9.9 .9 un that is one dollar fifty one dollar fifty and the next item is my babies my baby's uh, baby nourishing hair and body wash i always use this uh, it's doing good on his skin i bought it for 14.9 un and that's two dollars 36 two dollars 36 and um, the next item on the book is disinfectant yes we we need disinfectants in in our houses so i use disinfectant to clean the floors since i have a little kid uh, i need to clean the floors because sometimes you eat something that has been dropped onto the floor i use this to clean some kitchen counters i uh, use this to clean the toilets but not always sometimes so disinfectant i bought these three three five hundred new bottles for 7.92 un that's two dollars 20 cents for three 500 mil disinfectant my favorite peanut butter your girl loves peanut butter so much each and every day i have to eat my porridge or my oatmeal mealy meal porridge with peanut butter oatmeal with peanut butter uh, pumpkin porridge with peanut butter or in my language we call it no pea peanut butter porridge no pea peanut butter your girl loves peanut butter and i bought the peanut butter for 17.8 un that is um, two dollars ninety cents two dollars ninety cents for these two bottles of peanut butter 400 340 grams times two 340 grams times two of peanut butter um two dollars seventy cents tooth and i'm nurturing a good mouth hygiene for my son so i bought these two toothbrushes and this toothpaste for um, 9.9 un that is a dollar 60. he had some a toothbrush before but he chewed it and it's like it's no longer functional so the boy needs a good oral mouth hygiene then the next next item on the list is uh pop the main corn pop the main corn maputi your girl and her family likes maputi we have always eaten this at home when we were growing up and finding it here in china is a good is a plus and i bought these six these six big pockets of pop maize corn or maputi for 17.8 yuan that is two dollars 70. maputi we really like maputi and uh, i always have lemons in the house sometimes i use them when marinating some some meat and every day in the morning my my husband and i we drink lemon water in the morning on an empty stomach so we always make sure that we have lemons in the house so these lemons are 2.5 kgs they are big big lemons and they are fresh they came by sf uh it's one it's the fastest i think uh method of transporting shipping in china as if they came by sf and i bought the lemons for 16.7 un that is two dollars 65 cents two dollars 65 cents for 2.5 kg of lemon and the next thing is oats okay australian oatmeal 
I have Australian oatmeal here. I bought these two. <coughs> two kgs of oatmeal. Two kgs of oatmeal. And it was going for 19.99 UN. That is $3.20. $3.20 for two kg oatmeal. I like oatmeal. And the next thing is... You know, as an African, I need to eat my sadza. I need to eat my ugali, msima, papa. This is 5 kg minimal. I need my sadza. I love my sadza. Uh, 5 kg minimal, I bought it for 31.9 UN. That is 5 US dollars. 5 US dollars for 5 kg minimal. This is expensive when I compare to the price of minimal back home. <laughs> okay and the next thing is um listerine uh, mouthwash listerine mouthwash i didn't have any mouthwash left in the house so i bought these two 500 mils so this is one liter um, oh 33.9 yuan that is five dollars forty cents five dollars forty cents for one liters 500 by two of listerine and the next item is uh, toothpaste toothpaste mm, these three flavors these three three flavors i bought three different flavors for um, 12.88 un that is two dollars fifteen cents two dollars fifteen cents for these three toothpastes colgate three this three colgate i use brown and white sugar so i have brown sugar i didn't buy brown sugar this time i only bought white sugar this is a 2.5 kgs of yeah 2.5 yes 2.5 kgs of white sugar it was going for 20 um, 21.88 yuan that is three dollars fifty cents three dollars fifty cents and your girl loves rooibos tea a cup of rooibos tea calms my spirit calms my nerves especially during these cold days i'll just sit down and drink my rooibos tea and imagine that i'm at home so this is this is 36 grams 36 grams it's written camel tea south africa rooibos tea south africa rooibos tea 36 grams it tastes like just like the rooibos at home but this this is loose it's not the tea bags and i bought this rooibos for Nine twelve point nine UN that is two dollars five cents. Rooibos tea and uh, this Ingram's aqueous cream from my son. I haven't used this before, I bought it for the first time because um, it's getting warm. He's been using, he has been using Vaseline petroleum jelly during the cold season now i want to mix the petroleum jelly with the aqueous cream this is a product of south africa uh, i bought it for 140 un that is 22 dollars 22 cents it was quite expensive but i just bought it because in the case that we go back home i'll be able to find it and i I also bought this Ingram's tissue oil cream for myself. I used it before coming to China and I've been using it when I found the shop where I bought the Arcus cream. So it's 500 mils, 500 mils. And it was also going for 140 UN. That is 22.22 UN. It's quite expensive, but I like it. And I mix this with glycerin oil with the glycerin beef cubes 24 i bought them for 29.63 un 
that is uh, $4.70. $4 so all things that are imports are quite pricey. And uh, rose water, rose water, I use rose water to moisturize my locks and I mix it with some oil. $1.50, $1.50 for the rose water. I use it for my locks to moisturize my locks and the last item are my baby's diapers i bought these two packs these two packs they are 84 pieces of diapers i bought them for 67.6 .6 yuan that is ten dollars sixty ten dollars sixty for 84 pieces of diapers i've always used this brand since my baby was born and they are doing good for him they are chinese so this is my grocery haul and i hope you get a glimpse of how much grocery items cost here in china and thank you for watching my video like comment subscribe and share to your loved one i hope you are going to stay tuned for the next one Bye.